President Joe Biden stepped down from his 2024 election campaign and endorsed Kamala Harris for the job, but staunch Donald Trump supporter Roseanne Barr doesn't think the VP will end up on the ticket. It doesn't really matter who the Democrats choose because the president is Barack Obama, and he's in his third term now, and he'll be running for his fourth term, she claimed while speaking with Newsmax host Todd Starnes, parroting the theory that the former president has been pulling the strings of the Biden administration behind the scenes. You know they always project exactly what their own sins are onto the other, she continued. This is his third term, and I hope his fans are enjoying it. And his fourth term no matter who he appoints is going to be even worse. Starnes then mentioned the rumors that Michelle Obama could potentially be the nominee and asked her how she thinks that would play out as the election cycle continues. Barr replied, well that's what I think they'll probably do with Hillary Clinton as vice in their open primary. I think it's going to be a big show that everybody needs to bring their popcorn to. It's going to be very entertaining. The conservative comedian isn't the first Republican to suggest Michelle, 60, could throw her hat in the ring for the presidency. Texas Senator Ted Cruz has also floated the theory several times over the past year. Last September, Cruz said he felt the odds are very significant that President Biden would be dropped and Michelle would be their candidate. I think they're going to look to Michelle Obama as the savior to come in, he continued. And I think if that happens, that would be very, very dangerous. And every time I see a Democrat or one of their puppets in the press beginning to point out the problems with Joe Biden, every time that happens, the chances of that go up and up and up. Despite doubts Harris will be the Democratic nominee, supporters raised roughly $100 million for her campaign since the president announced he would be leading the race. She also won the support of major political figures including Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer and former House Speaker Nancy Pelosi. Officially, I have seen Kamala Harris's strength and courage as a champion for working families, notably fighting for a woman's right to choose, Pelosi praised the vice president in a recent statement. Politically, make no mistake, Kamala Harris as a woman in politics is brilliantly astute, and I have full confidence that she will lead us to victory in November.